Yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. That's spooky, all right. What's up, everyone? My name is Swift Edge, and welcome to Lazarus, the demo. I just realized there's something back there. I don't like that at all. So what we are doing in this demo is we're going aboard a ship that has not been found for the past four years. All because we've received a distress signal. So we are part of a rescue team that is going aboard this, I'm assuming very empty, but also not empty ship. Trying to find anyone that might still be alive. I have a bad, bad feeling about this. But onwards we go. Four years ago, a ship called the MTS Endurance disappeared on its voyage across the Atlantic Ocean. It has recently re-emerged. You are a member of a rescue team sent to investigate a distress signal coming from the once lost cargo vessel. In harsh weather conditions, the rescue operation went all right. All right. You are the only member of your team who made it onto the ship. Yay! You head below deck to look for any signs of life. Yay! Of course! Of course it's only me that's alive. Well, I didn't say any of my uh, fellow teammates died. It's just... I'm going that way because that's how it usually goes for me. And also... Ooh, oh, oh, I can actually see. I can see out the hole. Oh my god, I don't like it because it's just dark. Do I have a flashlight? It also did give a bit of a warning beforehand that this ship, that this game, is going to do a little bit of moving around with the camera to give the feeling of you're actually on a ship, which I really thought that was a cool thing to put in. It also can lead to a little bit of motion sickness, so... Because, I mean, look at this. You got the swaying of the chain. You got the ship going back and forth, but it's all, it's all in probably the motion of the camera. Of course, you're going to have to enable the assets like the chains and everything else to move with it. But it could also have that this base is moving too. I'm not entirely sure. But the thought of what we're seeing for movement and everything is all just based on the camera is a really cool concept and idea. But, oh boy... Oh, boy, can I open the door? Uh, let me look at the controls really fast, if I, if I may. Um, I just want to take a quick look. Okay, so there is a flashlight. What is whistle? Why is there an option to whistle in this game? Do rescuers use this when they're trying to find people? I'm pressing Q, nothing's happening. Do I want something to happen? I don't think so. I don't want to. I'm hearing radio static. Um, I'm not... Ooh. Oh, great thing was it was also tagged on Steam with, um... Psychological horror. Trust me. I'm a, I already know. Uh, I don't... I don't know any... I... I want to say that that's just regular ship noises, but I've never been on a boat of this size. I've only been on, like, small little fishing boats and everything else. Those noises I'm familiar with. Cargo vessels, I know nothing about. I don't know of the noises they make. I don't know what's normal and not normal. Okay, cool. That's locked. There's probably people that have been on boats that play these types of games. They're probably like, oh, that's just this, that's just this part, oh, that's just the anchor, that's just that. I can't even label parts properly because I don't freaking know. But, oh my god, I'm terrified. Again, I want to say that... Oh, I... Are you covered in stone? Are those particles? I've been watching a lot of SpongeBob because of my son. So I'm I'm thinking those are barnacles, but I can't help but think when I when I say the word barnacles. Why the lights turn on? Are you still okay, you're still there. Um Oh yeah, you're very much deteriorating. Can I crouch? I can. Let me get a good look at you. Yep, you're very much dead. Is that... 
a flashlight in there? Oh boy. I was gonna make a joke about Barnacle Boy, but this is no joking matter. This is all terrifying. One nineteen forty-seven. I'm assuming that's the code for upstairs. I don't like the looks of any of this. Are we gonna get any lore within this demo as to why? <laughs> How did I not scream? It can't be broken by hand. Well, not with that attitude. Um. Yeah, um, at that point, I would be jumping off the side of the ship. I bet there ain't nobody alive here. I you explored every part of the ship? Yes. You were only on there for 10 minutes. Yes. Because that's all I needed to be able to tell you. There's no one alive on this freaking ship! Like, oh my god. I'd like to think maybe someone would look at that the fact that I didn't just jump at that locker opening. And be like, oh! He's just getting desensitized to horror. No, it just didn't fully click in that that's what just happened. When do I get the whistle? Is that? Um, I wasn't there before. Dude, all these chains rattling are, is now starting to get to me a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. The atmosphere is amazing. The tone is fantastic. I'm pretty sure there are quite a few horror games that do take place on an abandoned ship. But I feel like there needs to be more. Let's be let's be honest here. There needs to be more horror games on ships. Yes. I'm sorry, what is that? Picked up anchor relic? Why am I picking up relics? I was hoping for a flashlight. I was uh I was hoping for Kenobi. No, I'm just kidding. I was hoping for some kind of key. Oh man, the deep thrums. Can I peek? Can I just. Is that the old Kraken? Can I open this? Do I want to open it? So the radio's going off. It kind of pulled me over here a little bit. Also because I was curious about if any of the other doors are open. So I guess we've only have to... Oh my gosh, look at the swaying of that light. That is gorgeous. Terrifying. But we're also on a boat. So things are going to sway back and forth. I've seen one guy who keeps on posting TikToks of him on a fishing boat. And the amount of swaying there is back and forth. I could never do that type of job. I couldn't be on this big of a boat because I think I'd start puking. I don't usually get motion sick, but being... Uh, why are you standing up and at attention? No, no, off the side of the boat is where I'd be going. Why did you get out of your seat? Did you open the door for me? Did you open the... No, because I, I already opened that door. Why did you get up? I don't like this. Did I hear a second set of footprints? You're not gonna start following me, are you? Oh, that's why I got the relic. It was to balance it out. Oh. Wait. Oh, that's cool. Wait, wouldn't it be going back and forth because of the swaying of the boat, though? Is there something moving down there? I don't... Oh, I don't know why. There's a part of me that just got sick from that, from looking at that. I don't know why. I don't normally get motion sick. I think if I was on a big boat like this, I would get motion sick. What was moving over there? I want to finish my thoughts, because I want to stay on a thought at a time. 
But now I'm on the on the thought of what the fudge was over there. I'm trying to whistle. Am I sure that that's the button to whistle? Am I sure that that's the button? Okay. Trying to whistle. Are there any survivors? I... What is in your hand? There's a lot of dark parts. That's another thing I think that would freak me out being on a big, huge cargo ship like this. Is there's a lot of dark corners. And I think it would freak me out. Oh, this is the door that I couldn't see before! What's in your hand? Is that a key? Don't mind if I do, okay? Don't, don't get angry with me. I hope I don't break your hand. It's a key! Am I just... Don't move. Don't... Wait. Why am I running? Why am I running? Why do I now have the ability to run? Am I gonna get stra- Please don't tell me the barnacle men are gonna start chasing me. I don't want any part of this. I want none of this, okay? I want to not have to deal with the chase scene. I am terrified. It didn't say anything in the game if it was going to be a survival horror game. So far, I have no idea. Okay. Okay, I don't want to do this anymore. I'm, I'm quite fine. I'm quite content with Jonas jumping off the side of the ship. I will punch you in the face. You know... This would be a great time to pull on a flashlight. You're on a rescue team. Why would you not have a flashlight on you? Are you telling me of all the equipment you brought, you don't have a flashlight? Did we even bring flares? We gotta have something that would signal us to be able to get picked up or something. I mean, we're in the middle of a storm, so obviously we're, we would probably have to wait until the storm subsides. Unfortunately, oh, there's more barnacle men. But again, I have nothing that tells me why it is that every single person and occupant on this ship is barnacled. Oh god, it's hell. Can I just pick one of these things up and take it with me? I don't want to go over there. I definitely don't want to go down there. Oh, oh god. Oh god, I don't want to do anything here. Well, I can't go down there anyway. As long as none of you move. Oh, mama. Oh, mama. I'm just gonna run, 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 I'm just gonna run. I'm running to the end of the hallway, and nothing better come out and stop me, or I'm going to scream. We're fine. We're fine. Okay. No, I didn't come over here for nothing. I didn't come over here for nothing. Holy fudge. You want me to run through a dark? I didn't mean to do that. I have a feeling I stepped on it. And I didn't mean to. Seriously, where's... Wait, what was that? Oh, P is to pause! Okay, I don't like this. I'm gonna run. <laughs> Oh boy! Oh boy! I'm just gonna take that from you. I'm now having a blunt instrument here. So, did the crew just go insane? And you're gonna slink down, aren't you? Yeah, that's a lot of blood. Um, I now have a weapon. I want you all to know that. I have a tool. I will bash in your barnacle brains. Can I pry open a door now? That's not what I got it for? Okay. Um, 
Not really sure why I got a crowbar now. It would have been perfect for that door that was like, cannot be broken with human hands. Why are you looking at me? Seriously, why? How the fudge did you... I'm getting really tripped out by some of y'all. Am I supposed to take this back upstairs now? I'm gonna... I'm gonna try that. Because it says, cannot be broken by hands. Oh, I'm just gonna go back over here, if you don't mind. Thank you. At least this way wasn't completely locked off. I'm not a big fan right now. I'm not a big fan of this atmosphere. It's really good. It's scaring the crap out of me. I'm just not a big fan of it. Wait, that door closed behind me. And it's open again! Alright, time to see what's behind the magic door number one. Or is it two at this point? I don't know. I'm gonna go with two. I feel like two is probably the better thing. Um... Here's a flashlight. What does this say first? The statue started to appear on the third day. Wait, those aren't... Those aren't barnacle men? That wasn't the crew being turned into... There were just statues? It was just one or two at first, but more would show up every day, and by the end of the week, there were dozens of them. Is there anything else? Nope, that's it. Okay. Oh, no. Multiple pages have been torn out. Some of these statues have started moving. They've killed three people already. Uh, when evacu evacuating the quarantine areas, I whistled to get the crew's attention, and one of the statues whistled back. No. We've only had one more fatality in the last week. The sentient statues will always whistle back and it's proven an effective way of avoiding danger. Though they won't respond if you're too close. Still, I think it'd be best for the rest of us to find a safe place to hold up for now. Multiple well, pages have been torn out. There's not many of us left now. The engines have stopped, but we can't get to the bridge. There's something else on this ship and it stalks the corridors looking for survivors. The safest place for us right now is in this room. I just hope we're rescued soon. No, 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 I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. It was one thing, it was one thing to know from the game's options that I could whistle. It's another thing to put into practice and have it work. I need something. I got me a cup of go-go juice, and what I mean by when it works is when you do it, and then something else whistles back to you. I absolutely hate that. Oh God! Oh. So does that mean he's whistling? Does that mean he's whistling back to me? That means that these statues were just out here killing people left and right. Why am I able to hide? Wait, does that mean these statues can kill me? No, I actually have a lot of questions because now you're also in a locker, which... You're not gonna whistle at me, are you? It's because I'm right here. It's because I'm in the know. But then all of a sudden now you're gonna throw something because now it's not just the statues I have to watch out for. Okay, so it's over there. Ooh. But then you're gonna throw the fact that there's something else in this ship? Dude, I can't. I can't. So, because I have the flashlight, do I have to go back down here? What am I supposed to do here? I don't know what to do here. Ooh, I absolutely, I absolutely, absolutely hate it. Oh, so they're... Oh my gosh. Yeah, I know you were there. So this was actually open. It just blocked me from entering. Oh god. Okay, so that's really far away. So does that mean that not every single statue is going to kill me? Uh, only certain ones? Okay, so at least we got lore. The crew was getting killed by the statues, but it could have also been something that was messing with their minds. It could have just been some... 
psychotic break that they were having. I mean, being out at sea is going to cause a lot of issues. I'm whistling. Nothing's whistling back. I don't like that. Mmm. Didn't really want the answer. Delayed. Of course, none of you are going to whistle back at me, huh? So, what causes you guys to move? Let me guess, it's locked from the other side because there's a statue on it? Oh, it was just a circle. That's because there's another door. It was one of... What was that? What was that? I feel like I peaked the mic right there. Oh, are you watching a movie? What you watching? Is it something good? I have to interact with that. That's that's great. So I guess not every single locker has the ability to hide. I'm so freaked out. I have no idea if the full game's gonna go screw you. You might actually have to run from these statues in the beginning. Or if it's just going to go the route of, hey, we're going to be nice to you because the demo could easily screw me. Could e Hide, 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 hide. Take a sip of the go-go juice. What the fudge is that? Oh, he's big. He's also got leafage around him. That's seaweed, isn't it? Oh god. Oh god, you got coral on you? You got seaweed on you? You got rope? My man, you crawled out of Bikini Bottom. You probably came out of Bikini Bottom after you murdered in the entirety of Bikini Bottom. Oh my god! I'm waiting for him to leave. Uh-uh. So, uh, can you stop with those noises? Because now that's going to freak me out even more. He, he kicked that door open. I don't remember it shutting. Yeah, you know, I wouldn't want to look at it either. I don't want to whistle now. Because I'm scared. <clears throat> what is, what am I supposed to do with this? Are you wanting me to look out for a clock? I'm I'm assuming that this is wanting to be like, hey, keep an eye out for a clock. Because I'm pretty sure the where the hands are is going to designate what the code is. That's what I'm thinking. Oh. My. God. I. Hate. Every bit of this. Now I gotta keep an eye out for a freaking clock? <clears throat> oh, that case is going to have the real, isn't it? Isn't it? Yeah, I whistled. Something better whistle back. Oh, the clock, the clock, the clock, the clock, the clock. 11.07. 11.07. I think that's the code. What the actual fudge? You know, it's also the morning time when I'm recording this, so... I don't know why, but it seemed like that just got brighter. Would it not be 11.35? My brain is not working. Why do I need a screwdriver? What did I need a screwdriver for? Was it to put it inside the real thing? Okay, so is that answering my question of, yeah, it's just wandering around now? Is it just wandering around pursuing the halls looking for me? Because I got to tell you, not a big fan of that. This is going to be a survival horror game, isn't it? Uh, okay, so I don't use the screwdriver for that. What was around here that I needed a screwdriver for?
You went down that way. I don't want to go that way. Can I use it to pick a lock? Or... Because I think I need something for this. Holy fudge me! God, there's so many of you and I hate it. Wait a minute. That's what I'm using the screwdriver for! The vents! We're now entering vents. That's... That's delightful. That's... Not at all what I want to do right now in this very moment. Oh, I'm not entering vents for a long time. Thank God. Oh, look at you. There is one of you in here. Hey. Okay. Oh, the projection slides! The projector slides! What is this? Oh, it's the moon sigil! I do need something for that door! I don't know if that was like a full game kind of thing, or if we were gonna get to see what was with that door. But we did! Again, I'm not the biggest fan of this so far. I mean, the atmosphere. Everything else about this is just fantastic. The atmosphere is, like, getting to me. So when I say that I'm not a fan of this, I'm actually a fan of it because it's scaring the crap out of me. It's doing a good job. Oh, so I don't have to line that up at all? Are you seeing this? Okay. Can, can we run that back real quick? Can you hit that for me, buddy? Thank you. Okay, so that this room. What is that? Is that a corkscrew? Are you seeing this? Is that a corkscrew? Have I seen this room before? So going from that, I'm pretty sure I have not found that room. Or I maybe have, and it just didn't stick out because you needed to first find the slides to then have that become a pick up, uh, not a pick up object that does not feel right at all. Chromatically, that hurts. None of you want to whistle? None of you want to whistle at me? Hmm? Hmm? You don't want to make me feel special? Oh, <gasps> it's in this room. What is this? What am I, ooh, I'm moving this. Okay, because this was blocking. And the projector sides, this wasn't here. God, that's a lot of ringing. Pop it open, baby. Oh, we got the sun. Do I have to hide? Do I have to hide? Is that thing still walking around here? Is this all scripted so far? It feels heavily like it's scripted so far. Hey man, as long as none of you grab me, we're gonna be A-OK. -okay. Oh, hi there. Hi there. Um, I would like to not do this. Thank you very much. Open up, open up, open up, and open up, and open. Oh my god, it's not gonna open up in time. Is this where the devil's gonna end? You got some big hands. You're pretty, you know that? Ow! Did you throw me through the right door or the... Oh, you threw me through the left door. I'm gonna run now. I'm gonna run now. This seems like the best option. Oh, you're kind of fast. Oh my god. Why are you so big and fast? Open the door! Squid! Turn it! Stop. It's not enough. It's not enough. It's not enough. Oh! Well, that was useless. He's gonna snap my neck now, isn't he? Oh my god. Hi! Did you just slam me through the floor? Rude! We're hoping to release the full game in early 2023. I am definitely wishlisting this. This was... <coughs> what happened to my voice? There we go. This was great. Again, when I say I don't like this, know that I actually do enjoy this. This was really fun, really spooky. The whistling mechanic, absolutely love that. 
the swaying back and forth, fantastic. Just everything from the look, the sound, the feel, all of it was great, and I highly recommend that you check it out for yourself. Links in the description below to go and play this out and experience it and get that full motion camera feel because that was, ooh, I love it. I love it. I love it a lot. I cannot wait to play the full game of this. It's probably going to scare the crap out of me. I'm probably going to die lots because I'm probably not going to find lockers. <laughs> But whew, if you enjoyed this though, make sure to smash that like button, leave a comment down below and let me know what you thought about this. If there's any games you'd like to see me play for future videos or series, leave a suggestion down below to take them all into consideration. And if you're new around here and you've been enjoying what you're seeing, why not click that subscribe button and click that bell so you get notified of my next video. I will see you on the next one. Bye!